Hi, my name is Lefred and this is MySQL Shorts. Let's see how to install the latest MySQL 8.0 or the latest MySQL Innovation release on Oracle Linux 8, Red Hat Enterprise Linux 8 or CentOS 8. So if we try to install the MySQL server after we just installed Oracle Linux 8, what we see, we have one version, so in this case 8.0.32, which is not the latest one. So to be able to install the latest one, what we need to do is to remove the MySQL module that is installed by default as a repo in the MySQL 8. So what we do here, it's sudo dnf module disable MySQL. This command has to be done as root, of course. So we disable that module. And now we go to uh, devmysql.com in the downloads and we search the MySQL community downloads, the MySQL YUM repository, and we take the one for MySQL Red Hat Enterprise Linux 8 or Oracle Linux 8, and we download the package. So we uh, copy the link, and now in our instance, we install that package for the MySQL 8.0 community release. And this is how we install it. Very easy, sudo rpm-ivh and the link. Now we can try again to install MySQL server. And what we can see directly, it's that now we have the latest MySQL 8.0 release. If we want to install the innovation release, we need to enable the repo MySQL Innovation Community. So when we install MySQL Server enabling that repo, the MySQL Innovation Community repo, the proposed MySQL Server version to install here in this case is 8.2.0, the latest innovation release. So we can say yes. And we, we are installing MySQL Community Server 8.2 Innovation Release on this Oracle Linux 8. If we want to install MySQL Shell, it's exactly the same. If we do sudo dnf install MySQL Shell, we have the latest 8.0 version, 8.35 as we speak. And now, if we enable another repo, MySQL Tools Innovation Community, we will have the possibility to install the latest MySQL Shell innovation release. In this case, MySQL 8.2, as we can see here. Don't forget, it's always better to use the latest MySQL Shell version better to use an innovation release with a MySQL 8 version. It's installed. We can run MySQL shell to see the version installed and we can verify that it's indeed the right version. Thanks you for watching. Please make sure to hit like and subscribe.